All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's speed, 180,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to be the game? Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice? Then I shall settle for 500,000. And ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. <laughs> Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey! Stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You letting him get away! You speak! Sparish! What? Sam, tell me you got the cross. Got St. Dismas right here. You wanna say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. Non ce la fa. Proveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. I'm on my way. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. I'm just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh, scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. 
Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I were... You'd want. <coughs> All right, fine. <coughs> Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. <coughs> nice try. I gave you that one. That's not nice. Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Did you know all the artifacts here are stolen? They belong in a museum. I'm really losing my patience. All right, look, I'm still a little jet lagged. Oh, son of a. Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smart ass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Alright, I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? I just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. Okay. 
Vieni fuori! Ora! Almost to the bar room. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Back up. There's that front just outside the ballroom. I'll meet you there. Nathan, they brought more friends! We need to get the hell out of here! Muck! 
way! Right behind you! Sully, we're running out of time here! Hold on, kid, nearly there! Almost there! Unless you're driving a hearse, you better hurry! for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. It's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good, sir. Dangerous insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris in paradise. Today you will join me in paradise. paradise. It's when Jesus said to St. Dismas on the cross, right? But what about these numbers here? What do you, you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the uh, year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but it means we have date of birth, date of death, and Paradise, which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard it's way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and her whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. Look, with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. Things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and I can I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey, hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. But it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? 
Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay, I love you too. Bye. Just told her that the job is going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. <laughs>